What's going on guys and gals of YouTube? It's Big D518, and I am here today with episode 29 of our Pokemon Leaf Green Nuzlocke Randomizer. And the last episode didn't really do too much for the storyline, just got a few more encounters here and there. And in today's episode, we are actually going to be taking on the Safari Zone and getting that out of the way. Now, I left it up to you, the viewers, to let me know if you wanted the Safari Zone to be treated as one big encounter or if you wanted me to treat each zone as its own four encounters. And what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to use it as its own four encounters because there were a lot of you that actually gave me that feedback. So if you guys are hyped for today's episode, make sure you smash that like button down below. If we can get this video up to and or exceed five likes, like I normally do, I will guarantee a new episode of Leaf Green on your newsfeed the very next day. Uh, before I go, I'm actually not really going to do a team recap because we're not really going to need them. Um, if anyone out there, because I've actually had a few people uh, semi-reach out to me and ask me... Hold on a second. Oh, my mouse is on the screen. Oh, sorry. Unfortunate with, unfortunately, with this mic... You guys can hear me pretty clearly. With this mic, I actually do not have a mute button, and I just had a small little cough attack, so do forgive me. Uh, but if anyone out there would like to try or like to send out fan art or like some kind of uh, depiction of like my mascot and stuff like that, because you guys all know my mascot is Kyogre after all, uh, I'd love to see it. And who knows, I might actually use some of that for, like, thumbnail art, for banner art, if you guys want to create banner art for me, or, like, an icon for my YouTube channel. Like, I'd love to see it, and I'd love to, you know, give it a try. So, just putting that out there if anybody wants to try that. But, that being said, we're going into the Safari Zone. And we don't have a lot of money. We need to start battling some gym, gym leaders again. Let me, let me, hold on, hold on, it's way too bright here, hold on a second. Now it's too dark. Um, actually this isn't too bad. I'm just gonna leave it like this. Sorry about that guys. Uh, but, let's see if we can pass this area. So I think this is the last area, and let's go into here. So this would be area number one, if you guys are keeping count at home. And again, duplicates and all that other claw stuff is in this, so... Okay, so far so good. Not that I'm trying to avoid everything, but... Team 36 heal build. Oh, okay, so first area our encounter is... I don't have a Marowak. So, let's go with the Cubo. He's watching me carefully. I like how it bounces around. <laughs> see if we can catch this thing. And, hey, we got the Cubo. Alright, so Cubo. Yeah, we don't have a Marowak. A lonely Pokemon, because it never removes its skull helmet. No one has ever seen this Pokemon's real face. Huh. Uh, I'm gonna call you something easy. And call you Faceless. Because we don't know what you look like. Alright, let's escape out of here. I might go back into the Safari Zone to get any items that I missed. Like that deep sea scale. Because that is so useful. Berry juice. I think that just heals HP and such. But let's grab uh, let's see what else I could have possibly caught. Ooh, a, ooh, a leaf. The leaf would have been interesting, all things considered. Alright. Now let's get into the second area over here. And second area encounter for us will be. Ooh, a lantern! I like lantern. Lantern's definitely a good Pokemon with its typing. If it has the correct ability, this should actually be really, really good. And I hope it is. 
Oh, come on, Lantern. I don't want to throw anything at it because I feel like it's going to run. Oh, come on. Oh, I accidentally misclicked onto Safari Ball again. What can I do? Oh, come on. That's so bait. Let's see what it does. Alright, sweet. It's eating now. So it's distracted by food. Now it's like good. Doesn't even shake that time. Lantern, you're eating. Just stick. Something rocked you now. Go ahead and be angry. I'm gonna catch you now. You stay in the safari ball. I'm gonna use all my safari balls on this. Ugh, come on! Come on, Lantern. Oh, come on! Oh, another rocket shoot. Go ahead and be angry. What are you gonna do? You're just gonna sit there. Oh, come on! And you finally fled. Fuck you. I don't like you anyways. What else could I have caught? Oh, you're back again? Well, I don't want you anymore anyway, so... Bleh. TM09 rest. Oh, that's a good useful TM. A shell shell. Oh! Sh that was only useful in this game. But there's a couple main reasons why we're here. To get that. Oh, that's a that's a fantastic TM! I really want to teach somebody self-destruct, now don't I, in a Nuzlocke? <laughs> this is the main reason why we wanted to come in here. So now, we have Surf. A fantastic fucking move that we can replace Muddy Water with on God. But, we actually still have another encounter over here. Let's see what we can get in the water with the Super Rod. Alright, what do we get? What do we get? Do I have a Pidgey? No, I don't have a Pidgey. Interesting. Interesting. I don't know. Huh. I would have felt that I had a Pidgey already for some reason. Let's throw a rock. It's super effective! Eat rock, bitch. Oh, you're still standing there. You obviously want to get caught. So just stay in the Safari Ball. Thank you. See, why, why was Pidgeotto so, you know, you know, easy to talk to? The bird Pokemon, very protective of its sprawling, uh, yeah, sprawling territory, territorial area. This Pokemon will fiercely peck at any intruder. Well, there's only one thing I name my Pidgeotos. Or Pidgeots, I should say. Which is Bala. Uh, how many more steps do I have? 211. I think I can get some of those other items that I may have missed. Did I skip an area? I feel like I might have. Oh, you again? Well, I don't want you! Can I get that item before the time runs out? Probably not. Ooh, an Apom. Level 30 Apom, holy crap. 
you do? Fake out on me with your normal gem? Huh? Can I get this last item? Any more steps? Six, 69 steps. Oh, I think I just can. A lava cookie. Okay, that was not that worth it. Alright, for the last 31 steps, we're just gonna get our cardio on and just. <laughs> Yay! Did you catch your fair share? I guess you could say we caught our fair share, but. Let's go take a look at him anyways. Hope you guys uh, felt that that was, you know, worthwhile. Because, I mean, got some definite power. I mean, I'm not going to lie. Pidgeotto, when it evolves into Pidgeot, is definitely powerful. But let's take a look at him. Yeah, I had a feeling I didn't have a Marowak. Oh, my death box. Uh, let's see. Another lonely nature Pokemon. Uh, with Effect Spore as its ability. That's interesting. <laughs> Mud Slap, Earthquake, Bone Rush, and Jump Kick. That's actually really, really good. And a Naive Nature Bala with Rough Skin. With Gust, Vital Throw, Screech, and Drill Peck. So it's got some stab on it. Uh, but, let me take a look at one thing here. Oh yeah, Kappa's not on the team. Kappa is not on the team. Kappa is going in the box. Oops. Even though that's not the order that it came in, I don't care. Let's go return the gold teeth while we're here. Just get that out of the way. So that way we have that free space in our box. Yay, the warden. Thanks, son. You're a real lifesaver. No one could understand a word I said. Not a one. I was too ashamed to show my <laughs> to show my face around the office, even. Let me give you something for your trouble. And we got strength. Alright, who should we teach strength to? I feel like Jackal could probably benefit from having strength. But he can't learn it. Well, let me get Surf out of the way, because I know only one Pokemon's gonna be able to learn Surf. Yeah, I need the accuracy, especially on God. Now Death Jar, Havoc, and God can all learn strength. Let me check their attack stats, see who's got the higher attack. 61, 64, and 81. I kind of want to get Doug Trio out specifically for strength. Because I feel like Doug Trio can probably learn strength. And I wouldn't mind having Bo Bob GM on the team. Bo Bob GM, what does he do? He fucks him up. <laughs> That's the joke with it. But you know what? I'm actually going to end it off here. I'm going to check off screen to see who can learn strength. And then I'll teach that uh, Pokemon strength. And in the next episode, we will actually be going two houses to our left. And we are going to be taking on the gym with Koga. So if you guys have enjoyed your, this episode today, make sure you smash that like button down below. Show your love for the channel. Again, if we can make this, have this video reach five likes or more, I will guarantee a new episode of Leaf Green on your newsfeed the very next day. Don't forget to check out all my social media links down below in the description. And don't forget to check out my friends JohnnyBoy94, Blurry Cineplex, Pichu Project, Lucky Green. There's a whole laundry list of them, and they'll all be linked down below in the description. If they're not, please let me know, and I will put their links in there. But with that being said, I'm going to get up out of here. Thank you guys so much for your support. We are at 380 strong. I'm 20 away from 400. I would love to hit 400 very, very soon. But with that being said, this has been Big D518, and I will catch you guys in the next one. And as always, guys, thank you so much for your support, and take it easy.